In 1958, at the height of the space race, the United States Air Force came up with what might be the most audacious scientific proposal ever, Project A-119. Their mission, to detonate a nuclear bomb on the moon, targeting the moon's terminator. The line between the light and dark sides, making the explosion visible to everyone on Earth. Why would anyone consider such a drastic plan? After the Soviet Union launched Sputnik in 1957, America was desperate to show off its own space capabilities. They settled on using a W-25 warhead, a relatively small nuke, about one-eighth the size of the bomb dropped on Hiroshima. The project brought together some remarkable minds, including a young Carl Sagan, who worked on predicting how nuclear explosions would behave in the moon's low gravity. By January 1959, the Air Force came to their senses and cancelled the project. The project remained secret for over 40 years, until the year 2000, when Leonard Rifle, the project's leader, finally revealed its existence. Looking back, he expressed horror that such a plan was ever considered. Thankfully, in the end, America decided landing on the moon would be a better idea than blowing it up.